these little country roads and all of a sudden you see these light poles and flags and you know I kind of likened it to a field of dreams but the racetrack version of it. This photo was taken during a Christmas get together after Forrest had left home. We were so happy that he was there, but mom was pretty sad and so was Forrest. I think that the expressions on our faces kind of tell the story. Mom appears to be pretty depressed. Her affect is not a smile. She missed Forrest terribly after he had left home. That belies the point that we always celebrated Christmas, but it was still painful when Forrest wasn't with us. It was a huge thing. When it was first announced, it was a big deal. To have our name associated with the newest, most wonderful stadium in the country, which it is, is huge. This is the third year in a row that this has been named the number one arena in the world. That's what my dad always used to say. You can talk all day, Garth, but it's your actions that's gonna speak for you. This man can go to the grave very happy that his actions spoke for a very rare man that we all need to be more like. And uh, hopefully if people see this, then it'll affect people like a ripple effect where we'll have more uh, Lucases uh, in, the, in the world, and that's a great thing. For Forrest, I believe that Christmas happens for the very first time every year. He buys gifts for all of the children of all of the employees. He spends hours handing out the gifts for the kids. And Forrest gets to watch them, and he gets to be a kid again for the first time. We ended up building a, a race car for Forrest in 93. That's how Forrest started racing. He did that for couple of years. His business was really growing fast, real, real fast. It got to where the time didn't allow his racing. 